Welcome to the Trump Breaking News Network, your daily source for up to the minute Trump news. Join us today and every day. Here's today's news. This is TBNN. President elect Trump starts day by tweeting bold prediction. By V. Saxena. One of the very first tweets President elect Donald Trump issued Friday morning contained a message directed to the American people about the future of their health care. The Unaffordable Care Act will soon be history. He wrote, referencing President Barack Obama's widely panned Affordable Care Act, or Obamacare. The meaning of the tweet likely lay in Congress's move early Thursday morning to formally begin the process of repealing the law. Specifically, the Senate voted 51-48 in favor of budget resolution instructing committees in both the House and Senate to officially begin working on repeal of Obamacare. For the process to continue unabated, a couple of additional things must happen. The House needs to pass its own budget resolution. An official repeal bill must be introduced and passed through both chambers of Congress, and then the President must sign it. What remains unclear is whether Republicans will merely repeal Obamacare or repeal and replace it, which is what Trump has indicated he prefers. It'll be repeal and replace, he said during a press conference Wednesday. It will be essentially, simultaneously. It will be various segments, you understand, but will most likely be on the same day or the same week, but probably, the same day, could be the same hour. Moreover, in a tweet published last Friday, Senator Rand Paul, R. Dotke, claimed that Trump had professed his support for his own plan to repeal and replace Obama on the same day. According to an op-ed the senator penned for rare in early January, this plan revolves around empowering Americans with the freedom to choose an expensive insurance free of government dictates, save unlimited amounts in a health savings account, buy insurance across state lines and join together in voluntary associations to gain the leverage of being part of a large insurance pool. Were Republicans to simply repeal Obamacare, roughly 7 million Americans would lose their health insurance this year, according to the American College of Physicians. The negative feedback from simply repealing the law could damage the party's performance in future elections. By repealing and replacing the law, Republicans could avoid a lot of potential political heartache. What do you think? Scroll down to comment below. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is TBNN.